Some streaming problems with quality or consistency can be traced to your device's connection to the internet. In this series, we'll be covering what you can do to improve your internet for the best Twitch live streams, with this video focusing on best practices for Wi-Fi connections. Check out part 1 for recommended Twitch bitrate settings, ISP plans, and wired connections. Although we highly recommend an Ethernet connection, sometimes that's not practical for your location and setup, and you'll have to rely on Wi-Fi. Thankfully, there are a few ways to maximize your Wi-Fi performance for your streams. First and foremost, make sure you have a powerful Wi-Fi router, such as the TP-Link AX6000 or Netgear Nighthawk Pro. Honestly, if its antennas make it look like the Iron Throne, you're probably good. You'll also want to make sure your router's Wi-Fi technology matches that of your computer or your console. For example, the PS5 supports Wi-Fi 6, so getting a router that is also Wi-Fi 6 compatible will improve your connection speeds. Finally, make sure your Wi-Fi router is close by and does not have any walls between it and your console or computer. Ideally, have them around 6 feet apart. Then, just hope no military aircraft or solar flares blast in your direction and cause signal interference. The speed that you purchase from your provider and what is claimed for your Wi-Fi router won't always be your take-home speed, so always run a speed test on your device with the connection that you're using. Consoles will have speed tests in their network settings, while on computers you can use Ookla speed test or Google speed test. If you're getting low bandwidth or an unstable connection, reposition your Wi-Fi router and check for any sources of interference like other wireless devices in the path. Remember that the best connection for live streaming will always be a direct Ethernet cable connection to your router, but with these tips, you can get an adequate Wi-Fi setup. For Twitch recommended settings and our ISP recommendations, check out part 1 of the series. Want to chat with our community? Come join our Discord through the invite in the description.